Hello, it's Mark from Not Taught at School and welcome to today's video. So today I'm going to share with you two different methods for making money online or essentially side hustles. Now here's a cool thing about this, okay? These are both completely different to one another. So if you're not too keen on the first idea, please keep watching because the second one is awesome. Well, they're both awesome, but the second one is better in my opinion. And the idea for today's video came about because was over in this Facebook group over here and you can see this post was 19 hours ago and someone put this on here okay this afternoon I made enough money flipping appliances to make my entire truck payment for the month literally the best side hustle basically this person over here is buying products and selling them now I'm not telling you to go down his route because he's using the Facebook marketplace but you know in terms of a side hustle, they're incredible because, you know, people um and are about them for a long time. But then if you actually set them up, they can over time start to build you up a passive income. If, you know, depending on which one you go with. You can see like this one here, look. Someone started up a laundry service three days ago, posted a catchy message, da 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 look. I've already got my first client on, for ongoing iron service this week. And I'm not telling you to do iron service. But let me come back over here, okay? So this person over here flipping different appliances so I'm gonna take you back on a little journey to a number of years ago when we was first looking at you know making money online and from home so what is the method well for this one we're going to go over to we'll come to this website over here let me log on to this one and I'll show you this website so this is called gem wholesale okay now over on this website and this is just one example but this is the one that we used in the past so I'm sharing it with you you can find lots of websites like this in the UK and look if you're not from the UK it doesn't matter because you will find different websites like this where you are you know there's thousands of these available worldwide but the con the concepts of this is this point down here I'll highlight oh, I've highlighted the picture we are a wholesale of X catalog clearance surplus and customer return goods and they've been selling stock for over 40 years so a really simple example of this is okay so X catalog clearance is how it sounds surplus and customer return goods is something like say if I bought this microphone over here from Amazon can you see that I bought this from Amazon it arrived and you know for whatever reason I didn't like the fact that it was you know this bit here was black as, as daft as that sounds okay I could send that back to Amazon now Amazon cannot resell that on their website so they have a couple of options here they can either try and you know sell send it over to a website like this one over here gem wholesale or they can send it send it over to different auction um, auction houses and there's a number of these again all around the world but companies like gem wholesale they will buy customer returns and look it's not just amazon it's amazon ebay asda george tesco all of these companies and basically they will offer products at a huge huge discount and it will tell you okay so over on websites like this you want to always take note of this over here it's called the grades now if I scroll down here you can see look clearance it will tell you look stocks have been cleared from the source company to make way for new stocks so essentially they're new scroll down here Da, 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 da. what's this one here clearance again it will tell you then we've got these different grades okay grade one two and three now obviously grade one is pretty much the best one that you can get then we've got down here look grade two the damaged or faulty condition and it depends which one you you know you're looking at but if I, i'll give you an example of this okay so when we used to do this method over here we used to in the beginning we used to come over to electrical because over here you can get some gem, like gem, gem wholesale but you can get some incredible gems in here so we can see these are normally all returns okay so if I scroll down here look you can see that all returns pretty much all of them it's very rare they have clearance items over here okay so if I scroll back up to the top we can see let's start with this one we'll just go with this one okay so what is this electrical and kitchen returns a standard palette cost this amount of money over here view the stock list so what is in that palette now look at all of this in here what you get it's a hell of a lot of stuff available inside of that and it's you know it's all random different stuff so what is that a cake tin not great so what i would do is when i was coming over to this i'd look at you know the high items so like this one over here morphe richards this product over here what's that a bean to cup coffee filter and you can go through and have a look at these now the thing with this is because it is a return you're taking 
essentially it's a bit of a gamble in some respects because you know like some of these down here these stainless steel kettles and things it could be a case of somebody ordered it they got it home that you know they played around with it they had it for a week and then they just decided they didn't like it so they sent it back it could be they didn't like the color or it could be it actually stopped working so you know in this example over here you're getting a lot of stock up to here 1800 pounds worth but you know it could potentially not work or it could have issues with this so what i'd say when you are you know first starting out with this method try and stick to things like this over here like the mixed household furniture and also the diy and home also fashion because i'll give you an example normally you can find clearance items in here so we've got returns returns lots of returns down here. i've come back on the wrong one haven't i let me come over here let me go to bulk loads let's look at this one returns when where's the one i'm looking for is it this one diy and home returns no they're all returns as well let's go to mixed household scroll down you can see predominantly that the majority of this is returns but a lot of the time let me go over to let's go to furniture i'm sure it was one of these ones. ah here we go clearance so this item here is a clearance item so whatever's in here you can see you can buy this for 229 pounds and it's clearance item so it's not an item that's being returned it's a clearance then over here you can see we've got grade one returns come down here shows you the cost price and then you can view it as well and again but basically this is the method you'd go ahead and use a website like gem wholesale to find products i mean what is in this clearance 400 pounds let's see what you'd get in there tv cabinets six tv cabinets and then we've got this one over here we have got these three draw chests so let, oh, what i'll do is this here 65 tv inch cabinet oh i'm gonna copy that and i'm gonna search google and see what it is so we can see <clears throat> 65 inch tv cabinet See the exact one there, look, Camberley Long Oak, da, 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 selling on eBay for £380. Come back over here, it's saying that the recommended retail price is 229 So you can see on here, you could potentially make some decent money that way. Then also, you can obviously, you can sell these products on eBay, you can sell them on Amazon, you can sell them on the Facebook Marketplace, you could even, you know, create your own website and go down that route. But it's an awesome method for making money because you literally... So you're literally buying clearance items very cheap but obviously it will take time effort and obviously your own money so that there is method number one and look in terms of these different websites yeah i mean you can just go on here and just type in amazon return pallets and you can find them all over i mean you can literally even find them people sell them on ebay as nice as it sounds look you can even go over here look at amazon returns pallets you can go over there and actually have a look so I go there and then come down let me go to shopping i'll show you this really quickly go over here there you go one example ebay you can buy that product there on ebay palette kings uk amazon customer return wholesale scroll down you can find lots of these different things on ebay whereby you just buy it and then you flip it out, okay so that is one method for you the other method what we are going to look at which is in my opinion a hell of a lot simpler than this method and easier and it's free so you know it ticks all of the boxes and that is selling online digital products now there are so many different methods for that you can do ebooks you can do pdfs you can do courses and other bits but the reason why many people fail when it comes to you know selling creating these items to sell and selling them they normally think you know i'm going to create an ebook i'm going to you know do all the marketing myself and a lot of the time they fail purely because they struggle with the element of getting traffic so for this there's an easy way around it you can come over to this website here and i'll share with you some awesome tools and resources as well so etsy is a huge let me click on no thanks etsy is a huge website now when it first kicked off it was all handmade stuff but not anymore you can find absolutely anything on here digital downloads and lots more now when i've been looking through this previously you can see these different examples on here let i'll just click on one doesn't matter I'll show you this okay so this web this shop this is a shop on on etsy by the way this shop here look this is a certificate of completion template printable da -da -da -da. scroll down here look see this here digital download what will i receive so 
If I bought this now for £6, I would get a digital download, which I can literally download, print off, and, you know, do what I need to do, like put in the date and the name. Now, the ridiculous thing about this method is, in terms of this item here, this person does the work one time, and I'll show you how to do this using a free piece of software. They do the work once, they upload it over onto Etsy. Now, once it's on Etsy, essentially, to a degree, their work is done because they create the listing like this. So you give it a title, you give it a description, which is this down here. And then once somebody finds this item and they buy it, they get an instant download. So Etsy delivers this for you. Etsy take care of the payment for you and you get paid you know you get paid the difference between how much they buy it for and how much etsy take a fee from you for so it's absolutely awesome and this is just one example over here there are so many different types of printables that you can create and upload onto etsy like millions <laughs> there's so many different ideas so if we come down here we can say like this this person's shop here they've got look i mean all of these certificates here they're all five pounds. I mean, these are not difficult. And if you look at them, you know, is that massively different to that? No, it's not. All they're doing is they're just changing the colour and the format. Scroll down. We've got these different types of certificates. But let me share, share with you a couple of examples. Then I'll show you how you can do this completely for free. But we can see in this shop here, 2,000 sales. So we can do, obviously, people say, you know, th it's not the normal stuff is pl um, planners. Um, what is it? Planners weekly food planners, weekly food shops, keeping um, like a diary, all that sort of stuff. But the demand the, the demand is huge for that, but also is the competition. So, you know, you, you need to go a bit more, I'd say a bit niche further down with this. But I'll share some examples with you. So if we was going to, on here, we was going to type in, let's type, I'm trying to think, I'm trying to think of something. So I'm going to type in, let's, let's go over this one. Baby shower printables. Okay. So this over here, baby shower printables, currently gets, let me see if this is going to work for you, 7,000 people, let me move that, 7,000 people a month are searching for baby shower printables. 7,000 people. Now, if I click on there and do a space, we then start to get some different ideas. So Australia, people are searching for that. I don't know why. And then you can go ahead and have a look at other options. But if we scroll down here, look, all of these, these are all printables that someone's done the work once and uploaded it so you've got this you know this option here and you can make it as specific or as broad as you like but i was saying earlier about you know niching down if i was to come over here and type in something like unicorn or elephant or anything like unicorn baby shower printables scroll down the page here and then you know we can start to get some different ideas look unicorn baby shower invitation so you could create that we've got this one over here you could create that and i mean look at this this shop over here seven thousand sales come over here five thousand come over here one thousand seven hundred let's go up here and type in elephant like so and 210 people a month for searching for elephant baby shower printables and it's awesome because as i've mentioned it's a digital download file so i've got a few resources with regards to this for you so the first one is if you come over onto well i'll just drop a link down below for you you can go straight over to this article but i have what where is it let me go up here no not this one not this one so i'll drop a link to this one here there's a number of softwares in there for creating printables and then i'll also sell uh, i'll also <laughs> sell i'll also drop a link to this article over here which is how to sell printables online and make a full-time income passively because inside of this article we've got a full interview with someone who does this method and makes a lot of money online from printables okay so i'll drop links to both of those articles below for you but i said to you i was going to share some resources so the first one is you'd come over to this website over here it's called canva.com and this is literally what people are doing with this method. They are coming over onto Canva and they are creating temp they're creating printables inside of here. So if I type in here, I'm gonna type in baby, let me type in baby shower. Baby shower printable. In fact, I'll just type in baby shower. And I'm I'm gonna search literally the templates what are available on here. So for that example, I have got 3774 templates 
Now, remember, it's a template. You can edit any part of this that you like. So let's go into one. Now, Canva is free. They do have a paid option, and you will see where it says Pro, it just means you can't use that. Now, if you can afford Pro, at some point, I'd highly recommend to upgrade to it. But in the beginning, just go with the free one. And it's all drag and drop simple. So let me open up any one of these, okay? So we've come into this one. What is this template we have gone into? Would you go away? No, thank you. So this here is a baby shower. What is this? Natural watercolour baby shower invitation. So this is it, right? So I can obviously, I can change any part of this. I can just get rid of that. If I've done it by mistake, I do that. If I don't like the font, I change it up here, like so. If it's looking too big, I can make it smaller, like this. If I don't like the colour, I can click on here and change the colour, like so. And then obviously, you know, if I wanted to say this was for, let's say, um, Harry. Harry's baby shower, like so. And you can just change it, and it's honestly, it's drag and drop simple. All of these things over here, you know, you can click on them, you can move them around, you can rotate things like this, you can change the colour with this. And if you come over here on the left hand side to elements, you click on there, just type in baby or you know whatever it is related to that you can come through and find different you know images logos photos graphics so you know if i wanted this one i click on that it goes over here now all i've got to do is move it where i want on the page and then resize it like so but honestly it's so simple and easy to, easy to use this once you're happy with this and you finish playing around you click on share and you come down to download here and then you click on, I always say to leave it on PNG, or if you're going to you know, be offering this over on Etsy as something that they would download and print off, you'd go with potentially PDF standard, because you can see here, documents for, uh, sorry, PDF print, best for printing. So that is your option. Or if you want to take it a step further, you could download it as a PDF print, and you could also download it as a PNG and give both files to the buyer. But again, all you do in that example is you upload the files to Etsy. When somebody buys, Etsy delivers those files for you. So it's hands-free. And that is two, uh, that's basically today's video. So I'll drop links to all of the things that we've spoken about today for you. But w without a doubt, you know, these are two side hustles. The first one, obviously, you're going to be trading you're going to have to be putting your money in and you're going to have to be spending you know, a bit of time doing research and other things. Whereas this method here, it's free to get started with. You don't need skills or experience. You don't need money. And you can have this whole thing up and running, you know, realistically within a couple of hours from start to finish. And I'll also drop a link down below to these articles that we spoke about. You can check out the interview in this one over here. And then you can have a look at some of the different softwares available for creating principles. But overall, simple side hustles. So thanks again. Have a great day. And I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.